Hello guys, welcome to the first session of the Entity Framework Code 2.0 tutorials. The first question arises, what is the Entity Framework? The Entity Framework is a set of technology that support the development of the data-oriented application to work with the relational data. The Entity Framework provides services like tracking, identity resolution, lazy loading, and query translation so that developer can focus on their application specific business logic rather than the data access fundamental. The entity framework enables developer to work with the data in the form of the domain specific object and a property. Entity framework is ORM. ORM stands for Object Relational Mapping. ORM is a tool that stores the data from the domain object to the relational database like the MS SQL Server in an automatically way without much programming. ORM allows us to keep the database design separate from the uh, our domain class design, which make application more maintainable and uh, extendable. A typical ORM tool generates the uh, classes for the uh, database to interact with the uh, our application. Entity Framework Core is a lightweight, extensible and cross-platform version of the Entity Framework data access technology. Entity Framework Core 1.0 was released alongside with the ASP.NET Core 1.0 on 27 July 2016. And at the time of recording this series, Entity Framework Core 2.0 is in development branch. At the time of your watching, it was a public release. Throughout this series, I am going to use Entity Framework Core 2.0 Preview 1. However, Preview 2 was already released, but I am using Preview 1 just because it is more stable. Entity Framework supports the various database providers which include the uh, Microsoft SQL Server, SQLite, Postgres SQL, MySQL, DB2, Dewart which support the Oracle and InMemory which is commonly used for the uh, testing. We can use the Entity Framework Core in the uh, full .NET application which include the uh, console, WPF, WinForm and ASP.NET 4. Universal Windows Platform application that run on the uh, any Windows 10 device, ASP.NET Core and uh, .NET Core app which can run on the uh, Windows, OS X and the uh, Linux. I know it's a really boring to learn some theory concept of the any programming language or the technology. We will start working with the Visual Studio from the fourth session. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.